Welcome to your Sunday Shave of the Day! Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving and welcome back. It's good to see you. If you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave and all things straight razor related, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. My one word is heart and I put my heart into everything I do. And I believe every time you shave with a straight razor, you're going to get a better shave. Now, in this shave, I am using my ZY Grand Slam. Oh yeah, that is real wood, metal spacer, and a full hollow. Very nice. Yeah, this is inexpensive razor, made in China, but does the job, had it for years. Now, for my soap tonight, here we go. This is Wet the Face, and that is Vintage Barbershop with menthol. Oh yeah, gonna have another menthol hit. Yes, we are. And here's my brush. That is the Connecticut Quarter Brush. This brush I made, and that is a Maggard Razor 22 millimeter synthetic knot. Now this soap is really soft. And as you see, you just push your finger right in that. Now I'm going to get the brush wet and we're going to load the brush. So there's no bloom water tonight. Now I did prepare the beard in the shower. And I know that this doesn't, from what I remember, it doesn't take a lot. And I probably already got too much right there. So, but hopefully that's gonna do it. Now I'm gonna just get a little bit more water in that brush. And this is a cold water shave again. Yeah, with the wet brush technique for lathering. And it is a face lather. Mm -hmm. Yeah, working that into the beard. That is so good. And what a fantastic scent. Oh yeah, nice, 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 nice. Yeah, and I really enjoy the ritual of shaving in the old fashioned way. I really do. This is the most relaxing and comfortable way to shave if you will take your time and enjoy it. It can be marvelous. Yes, it can. Oh yeah, and I can feel that menthol. Feels good, it does. Yep, cold water feels good too. Yep, all right, here we go. This is pass one, and for me, primarily, that's gonna be with the grain. So let's do this. Lay that razor flat, raise it up about a spine width, then gently, weight of the blade only, Don't press. Very nice. Oh yeah. Yeah, it feels good. Look at it. Went right through those whiskers. Oh yeah. This is a fine razor, really is. Not expensive, won't come sharp, but you can uh, get it sharp. And it will stay sharp, so that's good. You could 
also possibly find it already honed up online somewhere as well. Oh yeah, nice. Very good. Yeah, with the wood scales on this, they are hefty and it's got some weight, even with that spacer, really good. Here we go. Nice. Yeah, that menthol feels good. There we go. Nice. Really good. Yeah, hopefully you are having a wonderful weekend, being able to relax and enjoy yourself, be with family and friends. Yeah, and hopefully you're having a nice quiet weekend, being able to unplug and just relax. Oh yeah, having some downtime, that is good. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. And hopefully you're getting some good shaves. Yeah. That's what this is all about, right? And I never found that. Let me find that before we get going. Don't want to hit that bump. There we go. Pass one complete and felt good. Yeah, I, I got a lot on my mind, so you'll have to kind of forgive me for that. Just launched the membership on this channel and uh, just so much to do, so much to do, but hopefully, uh, uh, it will be able to benefit uh, you and I will be able to still raise the bar on this channel and keep keep everything going. That would be great. Really would. Yeah. So if you missed it, you can get the short version if you just hit the join button right by the subscription 
button down below. Yeah, and that will uh, give you the short version. And if you want to see the long version, that was last Friday, Straight Razor Ed Friday special. All right, now this is pass two. And for me, primarily, that's going to be against the grain. We're going to do this in the modified style. So this is going to be on each side of my neck. That will be across the grain. Through here will be against the grain. Yeah, hopefully with the join button, you will see value in that that I haven't been able to give you before. There we go. Nice. Feeling good. Yep. Nice. Yeah, very good. This is a great shave. And this is a great shaver as well. Very comfortable. There we go. Very nice. Now the shave in the books. Yep. Excellent. Now, let's get that rinsed off, see how we did. Oh yeah, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, that feels good. It does. That's a good shave, right there. Very nice, yeah. There we go. Now, let me get that wet again. There we go. Because we are going alum everywhere. This is astringent and antiseptic. Great if you hit a little bump or two. This shave, we did brilliant. So no bumps were harmed in the filming of this video. But we're going to put on the alum anyway because it is my practice. And it helps tighten up the skin and those pores which is always a good thing. Now, I will just dry that off by patting it dry. Mm -hmm. Now, if you can't take alum straight up, go with a cold water rinse followed by witch hazel, all right? In my case, I'm going with the Thayer's and this is the rose petal. This is really marvelous, it is. And I think it's kind of a classic scent. It'll be fine with this shave and we'll be in good shape. Oh, nice, nice, nice. And I do put that everywhere. I do, I do. Next up, all right, my cologne thing. Osage rub. Oh yeah, baby. We're going to bring it on. Some more menthol. Yes, we are. Now, we got a little of that going on there. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Oh, and that feels good. It does. Excellent. 
And for my aftershave balm, I'm going with Lucky Tiger Vanishing Cream. Oh yeah. Yeah, T turned me on to this. Very good stuff. So we're gonna get some of that going right now. And it is gonna be fine. Yes, it is. Oh, nice, nice, nice. And that is nice and cooling as well. Click up here to see my latest video. Click over here to see a video specially picked out for you. Click on this one to see if I could only have won the series. Have a great shave and a good day, and I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.